Yo, what's up guys? It's Yellow Elephant and it is 500k pack opening time. And you know what I gotta do first? I gotta show you guys the new update cars I want for the wish list before we get into this pack opening real quick. 264, well actually, I've got four comments from the new updates, but we aren't opening up any plastics, so yeah, we're not really gonna be getting those. But then I do have the Underglow car, the Skoda Slavia. I gotta, I gotta wish list one of the cars with Underglow because my car's got Underglow. Maybe I'll throw in a picture this time. I normally forget when I want to throw in a picture of my car. You can also follow my car on Instagram at yellowfincx 30 or yellowfin underscore CX30. It's in also the link in the description, as well as my Discord is linked in the description. But first, before you guys skip forward in the video to the pack opening, listen to this real quick. You guys get to determine what happens in the pack opening. And I'll say this again when I start to open the packs because... Yeah, you guys get to determine what happens for the next pack opening. So, for every subscriber I get from this video, and I can see, like, my YouTube studio tells me how many subscribers this video gives me. Every subscriber I get from this video, every new one, like, don't unsubscribe and subscribe again. That does absolutely nothing. But everybody here watching this video right now that's not subscribed, if you press that subscribe button, in the next new update pack opening, I will open up one, sub one ceramic for every new subscriber. So if this video gets like 30 subscribers, 30 new ones, I'll open up 30 ceramics. If this one gets like 100 new subscribers, that's 100 ceramics. That's over 3 million in packs. So you guys determine how big the next pack opening will be for this new update. But right now we're starting it off with a little bit of some 500k action. As you can see, a lot more cars wishlisted. I'd really love to get this cater ham. That would be a huge pull. We've got some nice little off-roaders, some nice stuff. This would also be a very huge pull as well. So, yeah, a lot of interesting cars. And then in the Epic range, it's the Citroen XR kit car, the XC60 T6 Recharge, and then also this Caterham as well. That would be an amazing wishlist pull. And I had to throw in at least one Legendary in there. So the one Legendary I picked, the Octavia WRC. That would be a pretty cool car to have. Plus, we have all the other wishlists as well because we're not doing any specialist packs for this one. Maybe for the however big the next pack opening is, it'll be a very large pack opening. We could do some specialist packs for that. But as I'll say again right now, before I start opening the packs here, I'll click on one too so you guys stop. Every subscriber this video gets will be one ceramic pack in the next pack opening. So definitely hit that subscribe button. We're going to start off with a times 10 because it's the best way to get excited for a bunch of random new cars as they come along. Starting off with a Renault Zoe, which is not new. Fiat Campagnola, not new. Suzuki Splash, not new. Oldsmobile Jetstar, nope. Oh, and there we go. There's our first new one. Well, actually, I have a few new cars already. Put the Volvo 480 Cabrio, 10.568, decently high handling. Looks like it'd probably be medium ground clearance, front wheel drive standard. Does not look too bad of a car. Decent little car to keep around. Well, I'm keeping every new car I get, so it'll definitely be kept around. Let's see if we can get some more ones. Maybe some of those wishlisted ones, too. I believe they're in the hierarchies, like 28, I think, is the Underglow car. 25 Buick. 25 Volvo, not the right Volvo though. Ford Falcon, already got one of those maxed. Golf, already got one of those too. Holden, nope. Um, let's see what else. Mitsubishi Mirage, no. Juke, nope. 500, already got one of those. Cyclone, already got one of those. Oh, here we go, another new one. RQ28, Skoda Fabia, 1.0 TSI, 9.672. Actually looks like some pretty decent stats on it. Medium ground clearance, front wheel drive standards. That does not look like too bad of a car. We'll max out with 80 handling. Then here's a Hyundai Tucson. Lotus Eclat. Holden Monero. Fiat Tipo. Nope, nothing yet. Saturn Sky. So two new uncommons so far. That's not too bad. Um, we got more uncommons already owned. Now we're into the rare territory. So we want to see that bread van or that Citron off-roader for the rares for the wish list. And then anything else too that's new. Okay, we've jumped out of 33 RQ, so no more bread van. Dodge Stratus RT Coupe, come on the other wish list. Hyundai Sonata Pev. Nope, Genesis. Holden, nothing new yet for rares. Are we going to get no new rares? Yeah, no new rares and a wrong Citron. RQ42 to start with. Another 42 BMW Z3. 43 Corvette, okay. 43 HHR. Oh, there we go. New super rare. Citroen C4 Aircross 4x4. That's a pretty cool one. 10.372. Four-wheel drive all surface. Seems like a generic sort of all-surface tire SUV. Let's see if we can get some more good ones. Maybe some of the exciting ones. Pajero. 
Forrester staying at 45. Let's get some jumps too. Saturn View 46. Because still we want to see good cars. There we go. RQ49 Audi Quattro. That's the jump we want to see. Let's see if we can keep the flow going. 49 Legnum. Already got one of those. Oh, there we go. 50 BMW 530i. All right, now can we see a new update car maybe? Nope. 59 Subaru Suzuki. Not Subaru. Suzuki Kazashi. I believe I already own that Suzuki. Yeah, and the BMW is new, but the BMW is really meh. So for new update wise, we got three new ones at least. Volvo 480, Skoda Fabia, and the Citroen C4 Aircross. Not too bad for new stuff. I guess we can go in for a times five now and see what we can get from this one. Maybe some more good stuff. Maybe some more new stuff. Hey, there we go. First car, the Citroen E. Elise, 69 handling, so it could be pretty good maxed out. I think that's 77. Chinese car as well. They added quite a few Chinese cars. Honda Insight, not bad. Or actually, well, no, actually, mediocre. Oh, there we go, another one. Ford Escort, XR3i. Another new update car. Nice little Ford Escort as well. 9372. Dodge Colt. Okay, maybe we can get some more rares too, because we got a lot of uncommons to fuse away. So if we get some more rares, that would be nice. TVR Tasman. RX-7, Cougar, Morgan, hey, there's another, the BX Sport, this one was originally on the wish list, and then I ran out of wishlist slots, so had to cut it, but the BX Sport, happy to see that one then, since it was an X wishlist, Ford Telstar, seems to be those X wishlist cars I get more often than the wishlist cars, Lotus Europa Special, Alfa Romeo RZ, Morgan Plus 4 SLR, Lotus Esprit, Ford Falcon. Okay, a lot of rares, none of which are new. Oh, and that's a very high RQ early super rare. RQ46 mini convertible John Cooper works. All right, let's see some more jumps, maybe. 48, Bronco Sport, second super. This could be nice. Or there's only three supers left. We'll have to see. Okay, 48, Gallant VR4. I think there might only be two cars left. Yep, 49, QX30. All right, can we see something above super rare, please? Let's see. No, G37 IPL. Okay, that pack kind of sucked. But at least we got some new Ultras, and at least we got some new cars. Escort, E, Elise, BX Sport, Volvo 480 Cabrio, that, yep, that is medium. Fabia, and the Citroen C4 Aircross. Not too bad, honestly, so we'll add all those to the garage. There we go. And let's see the new update collection now. We've got two Super Airs, so I got to start working on that one. No new rares yet. Um, I've just got the one. And then the couple super rares. and Or not super rares. Uncommons. And then the one common. So yeah. Pretty nice. And so that'll be it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. If you like this type of content, make sure to like, subscribe, hit the bell. Join the Discord link in the description. Definitely subscribe. I'm Elephant. Thanks for watching. And goodbye.